Good evening, it's Brian at Fitzpatrick's Garage, Dublin Road, Calero. I want to show you this 2016 Hyundai Tucson uh, Comfort Plus. This is just a little magnet that we put onto it. I forgot to take it off. Um, so anyway, this is a Comfort Plus uh, 1.7 diesel two-wheel drive uh, Hyundai Tucson. Brian's my name. If any information you want in the car, please give us a call 045-531-000, mobile 086-843-1945, or if you come to the garage in Calero Town, just ask for Brian. Uh, if you want to see pictures of the car, www.hondacenter, sorry, fitzpatricksgarages.ie uh, or you might have looked on Dundee here as well where you see the advert. Anyway, this car is just coming off our fleet. There is very, very good value in these at the moment. I apologise for sounding like the big sales pitch, but there actually is. Uh, these cars are current year 2016 cars uh, with uh, 3,000 euros of a discount and they've also got free servicing. So normally this car will have a warranty It'll have roadside assist until 2021, but in this case, on these cars from Fitzpatrick's fleet, we'll have servicing until 2021 as well, so pretty good. Uh, so anyway, condition, no point in showing the exact condition. Normally I'll go around and go through the doors and wings and quarter panels. The car is as you'd expect. It's one six one car. It's only six months old, so it's exactly how you would expect it to be. Um, in terms of specification, this is Comfort Plus, so, um, there's four models, so Comfort Plus is the second. So you got Comfort, then you got Comfort Plus, then you got Executive and uh, Premium. But the thing with uh, Comfort Plus is it looks the exact same as the Executive and the Premium as well. Uh, really, really no difference on the outside except for okay, Premium gets a glass roof, but uh, that's really not noticeable uh, when you're standing looking at the car. So what we have is rear sensors along the back. Ultimate Red is a really nice colour. Uh, looks really well this evening actually in the sun. So as we're saying, parking sensors along the back. Got a full-size spare wheel. After that then, the boot. Obviously that cover comes over to cover your belongings. Or what you can do is you can let that back. You can let that back. And you'll see the significance of that in a minute. Handle underneath if you want to let the boot down. Uh, these are LED tail lights. Hard to see this evening, but you've got a section that comes along here, and then you've got these diodes all the way across. So looks nicer than the first model, which is what's called the Comfort. Um, in terms of how they are, right? What we can do is I can lift this, okay, and let the seat back. Except for I can't do it one-handed. So if you can just bear with me for a sec. More terrible camera work, courtesy of me. But lift and drop it back. So what happens? Then, compared to your normal seat, you got a little bit of extra uh, recline, and when you're sitting in the car, that is way more comfortable than normal. <laughs> so it is. So if you look along here compared to this one here, if I sit over here, it's comfortable, but I am way more upright. But in this case, it's actually only a really small amount. God, it makes such a difference. Really, really nice. But you'll see yourself if you come look at the car. It's only a small amount. Remember Toyota RS used to do as well actually in 07. And it was only a small amount, but it made a big difference. Armrest obviously in the back. Isofix on either side. Armrest as we said in the center. Vents back here because we're in Comfort Plus. Nets on the rear seats. Sorry, front seats even. On the rear front seats. Uh, electrics for windows box over here. Um, so with a Comfort Plus, we get a 17 inch wheel. Uh, chrome rails on the outside, tinted rear glass. Apologies if it's windy in the video, just a little bit of wind around. Uh, tinted rear glass. The other thing as well is Comfort Plus now has front fog lights. So you have your daytime running light, big park light up here. And then when the headlights come on, you can use your front fog lights as well. So you get a lot of light in the road. These wing mirrors incorporate an LED indicator. Electrics for windows and mirrors, and then we got central Sorry, not central. We got remote central locking. Obviously, we've remote central locking, but they close the wing mirrors as well automatically or open it back out. So pretty handy. System check. Anyway, we got cruise control up along through here, and then we have our menus over here for things like tire pressure, when's the next service due, cars travelled about eighteen and a half thousand kilometres, things like. Um, speed in terms of digital readout obviously have your analog clock but uh, how much fuel you've used average fuel consumption all that kind of stuff the average fuel sometimes you see in these videos are uh, pretty bad because the cars when they're getting cleaned they sit in the vaulting bay running and that really destroys the averages so 
they're not fair representations, but we can show you when you test drive. This moves back and forward, storage. Seat I'm in is obviously height adjustable. This one here moves back and forward, and this section here backwards and forwards too, whereas this one gets height as well. And then that steering wheel is rake reach, so it goes in and out and up and down. Uh, Bluetooth over here for mobile phone, automatic headlights over here, which will come on themselves at night. Dual zone climate, which is the significance of a Comfort Plus. Uh, different temperatures on each side of the car, in other words, and then where you want the air to blow and speed and front and rear and all that kind of stuff for demisting. USB and auxiliary, play music devices, charge phone. CD players are gone, unfortunately, so USB really is taken over there. Uh, but usually, radio CD setup and information about your Bluetooth and stuff like that is happening over there too. In here, parking sensors. So if we go for reverse, let's not do this. Oh, okay. So it's telling us in the radar back here we got a problem and then we hear the noise as well. Uh, does this turn off the auto stop start where you stop at traffic lights when sometimes the engine revolutions will stop? Uh, if you basically have engaged neutral and take it full of clutch. Uh, to save fuel. Um, hill descent control. And we have a sport or normal setting on this. Driver, passenger, curtain side airbags, all the doors have steel bars for side and protection, anti-lock brakes, stability control to keep in a straight line. Car's got an excellent safety rating. Lights, and these are pretty cool. You drop these down and these come out if the sun's kind of getting in those awkward areas. Uh, anyway, that is a basic overview of the car. Um, so, as we were saying, we will there will be warranty on the car until 2021, there will be AA coverage until 2021, we'll give you free servicing until 2021, we'll be able to do a part exchange for you, we'll be able to give you finance. The garage is here 65 years plus, so Brian's my name, hopefully this kind of car is of interest to you, or is there something else that you're wondering about, please do not hesitate to call, and thank you for taking time to watch.